bolts and nanotech and ammo and what have you. Now to go and find that info bot. Oh, one of those random mine guys again. Wow, he was t difficult. Yeah, if what's flying around there. Greetings, Executive Chairman Drake. Dispense with the pleasantries, Lieutenant. My sources tell me you're behind schedule. <gasps> you must prepare this planet to be harvested for our new world. Yes, sir. As you can see, everything is moving along as planned. I'm no. counting on you, Lieutenant. And as your former commander can tell dun, dun, dun. you, I don't take disappointment well. I love his yes, cigarettes, like a I robo cigarette. Make like WTF. Greg is destroying yet another planet. Yeah, but if that's the kind of help he's getting, I don't think we have anything to worry about. You should not underestimate Chairman Drek. He is quite dangerous. We <gasps> must find Captain Quark. Look, that lieutenant ah, doesn't seem dead. so tough. <laughs> Let's take him out ourselves. Perhaps we can persuade the lieutenant to tell us where Drek is. <laughs> now you're talking. Oh yeah. Planet Eudora. Well, <laughs> I suppose you better get onto that planet then. Oh, actually, no, we can't because we still got to get some stuff here. And also, there's a uh, planet of Ridiar, which is not finished yet. But aside from that, <laughs> now I've got to get three platinum bolts. Platinum bolts? Skull bolts, my bad. Platinum bolts is the next game. <laughs> we should get those now then. Right, I'm back at the um, the train station. If you go up the stairs and then go right, you get to a line of boxes, and that's where um, the crates are, rather, of luggage. Just jump over them. I've got this area filled with those Robo Dogs. You can be like stealthy and strategic, and like uh, you know, go and destroy them all one by one. But I prefer to jump in and take them all out. It's more fun. There's no more bolts around here. No. There's some there, but I'll oh, screw him. I just want to get the bolts and get on to this level. And by bolts, I mean gold bolts, of course. Obvio. Just make your way along these towers that have been carefully positioned and get the gold bolt. Number one of three. Sorry for the awkward movement there, my recording software went all haywire on me and stopped. Or rather, it started messing about a bit, so the footage wasn't playing properly. It's back to normal now, which is good. And now, number two, which is under the um, the front bit of the Gastron vendor area. You can see all the ships going through here, they're like tiny little things now compared to a uh, old ratchet. And the gold bolts in the middle of it. Yeah. What next then? Oh yeah, there's that one that was um near the fitness course, like I mentioned. That shouldn't be too tricky. Oh yeah, you can also just um jump up and like destroy the ships, which is quite awesome, I think personally. Back to the ship. You know, I really wish they'd give you the option to just fall off these things. Gives you more freedom. Even though it is a stupid idea, I know, but I would just like that, really. Oh yeah, um <laughs> just gonna add this in quickly. A skill point number you can get for um destroying the cork box. Which I think I mentioned before, but anyway. Yeah. And I decided not to film myself doing the assault course again because I thought you'd probably find that boring. So we're now at the top of the second island and you want to go to this bit here. Run, jump and meow with the old Healy pack. Down to this building here. I have no idea why I just did that. <laughs> Last time for a bomb. <laughs> And there's basically loads of boats. Boats? <laughs> loads of boats, that'd be hilarious. 
Loads of bolts and a gold bolt. Which is awesome. And that concludes the gold bolts. Yeah! Let's get the rest of these uh, bolts. <laughs> well, I said bolts so many times now. But I think that's it. So, back to the ship we go. I'm sorry about this part, guys. It's all like little clips of me getting stuff, but it has to be done. There was sort of an omnivench glitch there, wasn't there? Uh, oh, actually, I might as well also show you the um, weapons that we have. The bomb glove, because there's loads of. There's a little picture on the side of Ratchet. It's quite funny, really. It's like, ah! Bomb! And the pyrocita. It is a massive thing, it's awesome. And the blaster is just like, yeah! I had 007 skills, blood. And now back at the start. Brilliant. On back to uh, Planet Iridia. Which is a quite strange ride, actually. I don't understand it. It's like always night time and then it's desert, but it doesn't really feel like desert to me. As you just saw there, we've got all three golden bolts. Which is always nice. But of course, we'll come back here to get the blimp, which there was one there in the background, and to destroy the quark bot. Then we have necessary equipment. <laughs> Actually, um. I quite like the next bit that we've got coming up because uh, it's the swing shot part and it's really good fun actually. Nice little platforming bit. It's failed miserably and the pyro stick comes in handy. Uh, what shall I use now? Bomb glove! Yeah, these guys aren't too difficult. Just get away of their flame. You'd think that would get that chip, but it doesn't, it doesn't, so that's pretty good. <laughs> Ultraviolent ratchet destroys plants! <laughs> oh, that failed. I'm losing my awesomeness! <laughs> oh well, we'll find the end. This is like um, the outside bit, then we go into like this sort of like massive building area. It's pretty cool. And there's the swing shot bit. Starts here.